Now, let's move towards our second use case. In this demonstration, we'll explore how our AI agent can process transcript files and perform advanced analytics. This showcases a core capability of our platform, transforming raw conversational data into actionable business intelligence. For this use case, we're working with a transcript file. You have multiple options here for data ingestion. You can upload individual audio files, transcript files, or even bulk upload multiple files directly into your Google Cloud Storage. This flexibility allows businesses to integrate their existing communication streams effortlessly. What we're going to do now is ask our agent to upload this specific transcript file into Google Cloud Storage and subsequently perform a detailed sentiment analysis on its content. This process streamlines the initial stages of data processing and analysis. Let's wait for the agent to call its tools and begin processing. Observe closely what's happening behind the scenes. We're uploading this file into Google Cloud Storage. In Google Cloud Storage, we have a series of cloud functions running. These cloud functions are configured to create an event trigger as soon as new files are looted into the storage bucket. This event-driven architecture ensures immediate processing upon data arrival. Based on that event trigger, we utilize AI Generate, which is a new and powerful BigQuery functionality to automatically load sentiment analysis results directly into a BigQuery table. This creates a structured and queryable data set from your unstructured conversational data. This entire sophisticated process, from file upload to data structuring, is being seamlessly orchestrated by our intelligent agent. The agent confirms that the file has been successfully uploaded to Google Cloud Storage. Let me show you what's happening in our backend services. I'm navigating to our Cloud Run functions now. As you can see, we now have a file called Perfume Inquiry Call in our bucket. Notice the metadata generation is equal to 1, indicating it's the first version of this file. The timestamp clearly shows this was just created, and crucially, the job status shows as successful. Observe here, it explicitly states query executed and shows succeed, indicating the big query process was successful. The sentiment data is indeed being loaded into BigQuery, which we'll explore in more detail shortly. Now, let's examine what our sentiment analyzer has discovered from this transcript. The analysis reveals this is a positive customer service interaction. Specifically, it highlights that the customer was receptive to the agent's recommendations, indicating a successful and satisfying interaction. This initial sentiment score provides a quick overview, but we can go deeper than just a surface-level sentiment. Let me ask our agent to use the sentiment tool to extract more granular insights, including any personally identifiable information. Watch as it intelligently calls the sentiment agent again to perform this more detailed extraction. The sentiment analysis has now extracted PII information. This includes the customer's name, Priya Sharma, along with her email ID and phone number, all of which were present in the original transcript. This automated PII extraction significantly reduces manual effort and potential human error. Now. Here's something interesting and important to note, demonstrating the robustness of our system. Sometimes, the initially extracted information might contain minor errors. This is a realistic scenario you'll encounter with any automated system.
notice that the system initially processed some information incorrectly in this demonstration. But here's the powerful part. I can provide immediate feedback to correct these errors, ensuring the accuracy of the extracted data. Let me tell the agent, please correct that this is the customer's email. This truly demonstrates the interactive and adaptive nature of our AI agent. It can learn and correct itself based on human feedback, continuously improving its accuracy and utility. This human-in-the-loop capability is a key differentiator. Now for the really interesting part that extends beyond simple sentiment. Let's ask our agent to determine if the customer is interested in any of our specific product categories, based on the nuances of the conversation. Watch as it calls the agent again to analyze customer interests, leveraging its understanding of product taxonomies and conversational context. The system has successfully identified that the customer showed interest in perfumes and fresheners by analyzing the sentiment and context of the conversation. This level of granular insight is invaluable for personalized marketing and customer engagement strategies, allowing you to tailor offers directly to stated or inferred needs. Based on these specific insights, let's take this a significant step further. I'm going to ask the agent to create personalized HTML email content for this customer, leveraging the identified interests. This moves from analysis to direct action. The agent is now calling the content generation tool, which is powered by a sophisticated language model, to create customized marketing material. As you can see, it's generated personalized email content tailored specifically to Priya's interest in perfumes and fresheners. It's not just a generic template, it's a dynamic, contextually relevant message. The system even asks for a crucial confirmation before sending. Before I send this, could you please confirm? This built-in safeguard ensures human oversight in critical customer communications, preventing unintended sends and maintaining brand control. Let's explore another powerful capability that highlights the agent's integration with your existing data infrastructure. I'm going to ask the agent to check the total sales made by this customer and the number of orders placed. This requires querying your transactional databases. First, let me clarify that I don't want to send that email just yet, as we are still demonstrating functionalities. Now, watch as the agent automatically generates and executes complex SQL queries to retrieve this customer data from your BigQuery tables. It understands the database schema and constructs the query dynamically. The system intelligently created a SQL query using a count of order IDs and performed an inner join with the users table to link customer and order information. The results are presented clearly, showing this customer's total sales amount and confirming they have placed one order. This demonstrates real-time data access and summarization. Here's another great feature illustrating the agent's adaptability. I can provide feedback to refine these queries. For instance, if I wanted the count of distinct order IDs, I could specify that, and the agent would intelligently regenerate the SQL query accordingly, showing its ability to understand subtle user requirements. This truly demonstrates the agent's ability to interact dynamically with databases, adapt to evolving user requirements, and provide precise data insights on demand. So, to this powerful use case, our AI agent has uploaded files to Google Cloud Storage automatically, performed comprehensive sentiment analysis on customer interactions, extract and validate PII information with error correction capabilities, analyze customer behavior and interests, generate personalized marketing content, execute complex SQL queries for customer analytics, and integrate seamlessly with BigQuery for data warehousing. This demonstrates the end-to-end -end capabilities of our AI agent system, from data ingestion and processing to analysis and personalized content generation. 
Now, let's look at the BigQuery and cloud storage integration. The previous activation was successful, and the agent has uploaded the file to Google Cloud Storage. You can see the file here. If I go to BigQuery, the BigQuery table now contains the information from that file. We can see details like the customer's interest in the product, a brief summary of the interaction, the agent's name, and the URL. We have also built several Cloud Run functions that support this process. Our ADK is hosted here, and the Update Sentiment Profile function is specifically used for loading file data into BigQuery.